We are back here on Girl Talk with Jim Hines, and tis the time of year to talk about being as svelte and healthy as we can. <laughs> you are with Equilibrium Weight Loss and Longevity. Yes. And um, it's really about health and wellness, isn't it? It is. I think, you know, at this time of year, a lot of people make resolutions to lose weight. Just mm -hmm. sort of, it's like checking off a box. It is. Mm -hmm. And losing weight or having a healthier lifestyle is a little harder than just checking off a box, mm -hmm. you know? And well, it, it was interesting. I went to the, a yoga class the other day, and usually there are like 15 people. There were like 50. And I think it's exactly like you said. Check. We're going to do this. Yeah. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. And in about two more months, it'll be like four of us again. <laughs> that, that, that's absolutely right. You know, when we talk to people when they come in this time of year, it's about are you really committed to making a change? Mm -hmm. You're going to have to maybe alter your behavior at some social events. You might even have to clear your calendar a little bit. Mm -hmm. it, it is a lifestyle change that you're going to have to make. So losing weight a little more dramatic than just maybe eating healthier, but it is a change. And, and yours is a little bit more medically, I think you would call it medically supervised right. or... You know, why is that important or are there statistics showing that that's going to provide some better results? One of the re I don't have statistics, but what I do know in, uh, in my own practice is about a third of our patients that come in after we do their blood work, we find out that there are some things, usually thyroid, that either hasn't been treated before or maybe isn't quite being treated correctly because the numbers aren't right. They're helping them not be able to lose their weight. Right. So um, doing some hormone testing, some blood testing, et cetera, can help us figure out what the pre treatment plan should be for them. What is the, if a, if a patient comes in, what's the protocol or how does that actually work? How do you determine, do you determine with the patient what the course of action is? What is a treatment plan? Well, the answer to your question is yes. yes. We have a couple okay. different ways to lose weight. Uh, as you know, you know, one of the, our sort of primary one is use, use of HCG, but we also have a holistic nutritionist on board okay. so we can do customized meal planning, mm -hmm. um, getting the numbers, getting the blood work back, and then sitting down with the patient and say, you know, what's your lifestyle like? What are your objectives? Mm -hmm. You know, how, how do you want to go about this? And then we put together a plan based on, you know, on what's best for them. You talk about a lifestyle change as being part of the plan. I know that, that many people who go into diet start off very restrictive. How how do you um, integrate a healthy lifestyle versus this kind of restrictive mm -hmm. beginning, if you will? I mean, jump start, you know? Yeah. It's, it's great. Yeah, I'll lose weight on 500 calories, but how do I maintain that through my life? Well, one of the nice things about, I think, you know, I'm obviously I'm biased about our program, is that while you're on the restrictive part, you're eating fresh fruits, fresh vegetables, okay. lean protein. Okay. The same food groups. It's not, there's not an appetite suppressant. There's not... Uh, uh, prepared foods. Right. It's the things you should eat. So then, you know, the segue into, okay, when you, after you've lost your weight, mm -hmm. what you need to, the type of eating you need to, to do has already started okay. while you're on the weight loss program. Mm -hmm. Well, that but, makes sense. But certainly it is, it is a challenge. I mean, you can't go back to the, uh, you can't keep your weight off if you go back to eating the way you did before. Do right. you integrate um, movement into that? Yes. Okay. There, uh, yeah, there's uh, no question. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever yeah. you want to yes. call, okay. Yeah, I mean, it, it's that, that's, your, that's the adjustment to what your life's going to have to be like in order to, to maintain your weight loss. Right. Yeah. Uh, do you find that most of your patients, is it sugar's an issue or is it fats and greasy foods and uh, what's, yeah. what's the... Well, yeah. what? <laughs> well, we're, we're in the South. There is an element of the fats and the greasy food, but you know, are obviously sweet maybe, tea. Are there yeah, more are, sweet tea? Yeah. Sweet tea. People with sweet <laughs> tooth out there. Yeah, our patient <laughs> uh, base is about ninety-five percent female. Mm -hmm. So I'd have to say that we lean a little bit more towards the sweets, the sweets and the, you know, and the sugars. But is is it not about moderation? Is it not about intuitive eating and sort of walking the middle line? Equilibrium. Yeah. Balance. Mm -hmm. Eventually, your life is about balance. Mm -hmm. It yeah. is. Yeah. Friends, family, fun, faith, and front. Wait, what did I say? Finances. Finance. Yeah. It's a five yeah. S for <laughs> <laughs> Well, I think, again, it is, it is a good time to take a look at the way you eat and healthy living. And, and people, it's Fruit. so hard for them to do it, any kind, make any kind of change doing that alone. Mm -hmm. yes. That's the 
biggest thing. I think sometimes people think I'm gonna that self motivation, mm -hmm. and then eventually you just kind of like yeah. I can't do this. It's right. like you're you're your best cheerleader and then your own worst enemy. So it's so nice to be able to pair up with somebody and right. have some support and Absolutely. some accountability. Absolutely. I think accountability is a That's huge a part of it too. Husband, wives, friends, co-workers, when they come in in pairs or more than pairs, the success rate goes mm -hmm. up monumentally. What is the goal? Is the goal to keep the weight off for six months? For a lifetime? For a lifetime. Uh, for a lifetime. It's <laughs> a life that's, that's the health issue. Yeah. That's the, ah. All right. All right, stay with us. We'll be right back here on Girl, Girl Talk. Talk.